So, let's see now how to predict a person's pocket money. Last uh, session I told you how you can predict a person's date of birth. Now I will tell you a simple technique to predict a person's pocket money. How much money is there in a person's pocket or in a purse or in a wallet? Interesting, no? Yes. Yeah, how is it? it? Okay, you just have to follow these simple steps, that's all. Let me just go through each step, step by step, so that you understand and re register all the steps. Ask the person to take the amount he has in his pocket. You now the person will be knowing how much money he has kept. In case if he doesn't know, let him go to one corner and manually let him count all the money. Now let's suppose that he has got in his pocket 700 rupees. So the person tells to himself that he has got 700. Now he is not telling it to you, he is telling to himself. Next, ask the person to add 5 weight. So he is going to add 5 rupees. After adding 5, it becomes 705 rupees. So this is the answer of the second step. 705 rupees is the answer of the second step. Now let him multiply this answer by 5. So he is going to multiply by 5. That is 5 5s are 25 and 5 7s are 25. So he would say 3 5 2 5. Okay. Now double the answer so obtained. He has got an answer of 3 5 2 5. I am going to double it. So I am just going to multiply 3525 into 2. So this gives 7050. Finally, ask him to add his favorite one digit number. To this 7050, let him add any digit from 0 to 9. You ask him to add his favorite one digit. Say for example, he adds 6. So then this number becomes 7056. Okay. Now you ask him to report this final number to you. Now he would say to you that this final number is 7056. So what all the series of operations he has done? He just counted the money. You asked him to take the amount and let him tell himself that he has got 700 rupees in his pocket that amount you are going to tell him then you added 5 rupees it became 705 rupees then you multiplied this by 5 it became 3525 you doubled it it became 7050 you asked him to add any of the favorite digit single digit line between 0 and 9 let's suppose that he added 6 and finally he came out with the answer 7056 and he reported this to you. 7056. Within a fraction of a minute, you can say how much money he has got in his pocket. You can see the technique here. The technique is ignore the last digit. 7056. The last digit is 6. So just ignore 6. Ignore the last digit. Ignore 6. When you ignore 6, you will get 705. Then subtract 5 from this remaining number. The remaining number is 705. You are going to subtract 5 and you are getting 700. And this number is the actual value of the money the person would be having in his wallet. In fact, it is 700 of the So when you tell this number to the person, the person really gets you know, amazed. He gets shocked. This is another fun with mathematics number. And when I take up Vedic mathematics classes for you, I tell you how these techniques work. I am just trying to give you some impression that you can do wonders and really really wonders with mathematical, mathematical numbers. Okay. In another video, I will tell you how to find out solution even without knowing the problem. Okay.